Intis ang kanyang unang tira. Of course, Felix Apreco grabbing the rebound. Arminion finds a Bayan inside para sa unang uh, basket ng Season 4 ng MPBL. Sarangani back the other way. Ludovice. Trying to wiggle free against Apreco. Ludovice. That's last touch of Himpayan. Eight seconds on the shot clock. Ludovice. Finds Kaunan. Kit Jimenez. Back to Kaunan. Back shot. Wala. Rebound. Jamar Himpayan. Andre Arminion back the other way. Hanap si Felix Apreco. Hosting up on Marilao. Impayan. Jumper from Jamar. Wala. Rebound. Kid Jimenez. Whistle going against Danny Marilao. As uh, Felix Apreco and Marilao battled for position inside. Kid Jimenez ang uh, kanina pag uh, meron sa kanya sa starting lineup. And uh, the biggest cheers, of course, si Kit. Part of that uh, very popular basketball uh, vlog on YouTube. Now forcing that one. Ball goes to Jimenez. It's stripped by Arminion. Cabajo, Kumatake, looking for Arminion. And it's tapped. Arminion attacks. Tulang sa pecto sa kanyang tira. Apreco recovers. Mecca. Now with Impayan. Nine to shoot. Arminion fires. No good. Rebound again, Jamar in Payan. Pinigay kay Cabajo sa corner. Pinapantayan ni Jimenez. Gets the pick from Apreku. Apreku, the other way, baseline. Three-pointer is good. Para kay Brian Mecca. Five-zero start para sa Val City. Sanga trying to answer right back. Short. Apreku with the rebound. That is three rebounds for the Phoenix Abreco. Cabajo to Himpayan. Mecca. And off to Cabajo against Sanga. That is an illegal pick. Two luck guns on the court. Then it's a three more Himpayan. With a V6. Taken away by Mecca. Mecca will finish. Quick 7 to nothing start para dito sa Val City. That's 5 points para kay Brian Mecca. As uh, Valenzuela establishes an early lead here. Little V7 fire. No good. Arminion, long rebound. In Bayan. Naatake. Great defense there by Ludo Vise. Wala na Sarangani. In Menes will fire. No good. Marilao with the offensive rebound. Back out to Sanga. Ludo Vise. Three ball is good. And it looks like there is a whistle after. Referees signaling what looked like an sportsman like foul. Tingnan natin kung uh, ibibigay nila yung basket dito. Technical head, of course, Coach George Monsino as uh, take a look at the three ball from uh, Ivan Ludovice. Carlos there, his team struggling in the early goings. That's a three point basket for the Chris Pushing foul number seven, Daddy That's his second foul. Reggie Masivas coming in for Daddy Marino. 
Danny Marilla will sit. Reggie Boy Basibas comes in. Referees had signaled other than sportsmen like foul, but it seemed like they have downgraded that to a regular foul. They will count the basket as well. Tamuna tayo sa ating third, uh, second member of the panel, Mika Abisams. Maraming salamat si Delph. It's been a long wait. Nandito tayo ulit para magbigay ng saya kagaya nga nitong si Coach Alden Morante. As the new coach of Val City, he is looking forward to the season despite having just one practice with the team. Like the other new teams, he wants to see what the boys can offer today for future adjustments. Tsaka alam mo si Delph, kung maraming baon na energy itong Val City boys dahil kumain daw sila ng lomi right before the game. Back to you. Thank you, Mika. Parang ikaw din kumain ng lomi bago pumunta dito. Medyo maaga kasi dumating po si uh, Mika kanina But yeah, that's uh, great to hear uh, Coach Aldrin Morante The most important thing is we are back This is MPBL Jimenez losing his footing Recovered by Apreco Intercepted by Ludovice Sana Back to Ludovice Ludovice to Sana Three ball on the way Wala pa rin Ball will stay with uh, Sarangani. Ludovice. Apreko nakabantay. Ludovice gets away. Unable to get the layup to go. Andre Arminion. For a friend recovered by Hipayan. Arminion, Shumper. No good. Rebound, Jimenez. Former perpetual health guard. Finally turning pro. To the Vise. Takes off Arminion. Shumper is good. Para kay Ivan to the Vise. Five points. The former Sun Bedagar. Mecca. Cabajo del Fire. Voilà. Rebound. Ludovice. Sanga. Doesn't hesitate. Ball Sanga. That's a quick 8 to nothing response. Para dito sa Sarangani, the Marlins take the lead on this fall Sana 3. Former FEU Tamarao, deadly from beyond the arc. We'll be right back. Brand new uh, broadcast partner in uh, Signal TV. Well, mamaya po ang opening ceremonies. We start at 9 p.m. 
And of course, uh, second game natin mamaya, Imos, Bandera, GLC Truck and Equipment, and Batanga City, Embassy, Chill. Patrick Cabajo, the mecca for three. No. Rebound, Reggie Boy Basilas. Already has five points. Kaunan, attack. That's the second personal foul. At the line, shooting two, Rick Kaunan. Hey, Kaunan. First free throw is good. Good look at Coach John Callios, who uh, handled Kalookan. The Bahok misses the three. Sanga with the rebound. Kit Jimenez. Three ball doesn't drop. Rebound to Brad Mecca. That is a turnover. Ten to seven, ang ating score among ang uh, Sarangani, Valenzuela. Has not scored since leading 7 zip. But Sivas lost the handle against the uh, Apurendo. JC AJ coming in. Uh, played for Bacolo in our invitational. Down low. You need the floor coming in for Kitinas. Shot clock 12 seconds. Arminion. Open Sibral. Mecca. Mani Basibas. That's taken away by Arminion. Ganda yung anticipation ni Armin, Armin yun doon. But he commits the turnover and uh, balik ulit ang bola sa Sarangani. Sanga gets the ball back. Gator. Sanga for three. No. Armin yun. Mira ng tres, wala rin. Nagawan sa bola. And the tour able to pick that one up. Basibas, bit out of control. Naagaw ni Arminion. And uh, Ray Bauzon finishes Fire. off that turnover. As uh, Sarangani calls timeout. Balik sa Valenzuela, alamang 11 to 10.
Babalik ang Maharlika Pilipinas Basketball League and uh, we are live from the Batangas City Coliseum. Sa mga nagtataka po kung mag-isa ako, huwag kayong mag-alala, may kasama ako mamaya. 11 to 10 ang ating score. Uh, bola ngayon na Sarangani. So, Dovise has yet to get a breather here. Sanga once again in this ang kanyang tres. Sana bigyan din ako ng uh, lisensya ni Coach Jan na ganun ng kadami itira, no? Paul Sanga. Has uh, given the go uh, signal by Coach uh, John Calios. Ilatan. Ross closer. Naagaw ni Ludovice. Here's Ludovice. Runner is short. Ibani Abreco. And uh, he runs out of space. Jess Kilatan. Bola uh, babalik sa Sarangani. The defenders coming in for Paul Saga. Shot clock 14 seconds. Masibas. Ludovice ngayon Jimenez Jumper Mapasok niya para kay Kid Jimenez And uh, that gets the crowd going here As uh, the Marlins retake the lead 12 to 11 A minute remaining in the first period Pilatan Back to Mecca The leading all scorers with 7 Angie Pilatan Three ball, voila, rebound to the Vise. To the Vise, bounce pass inside, Pasivas could not get that one to go. Pauzon had a hand on it. Ajay runs into trouble, but Mecca has uh, been impressive in this first period. He's got nine points. Nine of the 13 of Valenzuela. Seven second differential shot clock and game clock. Sarangani has the ball. Jumper in and out. Loose ball goes. Ball goes back to uh, Valenzuela. That they will have the last possession of uh, the first period. Thirteen to twelve. Kilata goes to Aji. Oh, that was clearly a foul there. And that happened right in front of the referee. Their crew chief for today, Edmar Avis. And kasama niya si Daniel De La Cruz and Wilbert Panis. And that actually happened right in front of uh, Edmar Abis. Yung hawak dun kay Aji. Technical foul on the Valenzuela Sur Holtz Realty Incorporated head coach Alvin Morante for entering the playing court. Making matters worse para sa Val, Val City is that Coach Aldrin Morante has been teed up. Technical free throw for Yuli Dator. Yuli Dator will take technical free throw. Tablataya 13 with 1.3 seconds remaining. Ludovice throws up a prayer. Wala. And that will do it. Sadding first quarter. Tied at 13, ang ating dalawang kuponan as uh, both teams struggled for some stretches here. And Valenzuela got off to a 7 to nothing start. Pumalik naman agad ang uh, Sarangani responding with an 8 to nothing run of their own. And uh, both teams favoring the three-point shot. But uh, Val, Val City had the... Uh, higher percentage shots going in 
in that first period. They had eight points in the paint. Wala naman para dito sa Sarangani. As we close the first period at 13 all between Valenzuela and Sarangani. Magbabalik ang inyong MPPL. back at uh, Batangas City Coliseum para sa opening day ng Maharlika Pilipinas Basketball League 2022 regular season my name is Sidov Tupas and salamat at dumating magpasalamat talaga kayo <laughs> alright, now I'm happy to be back Coach Jimmy Gayoso! MPBL, good evening mga viewers natin, fans of the MPBL. Baka masyak kayo, nabigla akong nandito. But it's nice because it's like I started the game. It's 13 tight ball game. Sakto, sakto. Yeah. The Davise jumper is good. Imagine the Davise, hindi pa nagpapahinga to, Coach JV. Parang ako. <laughs> oh nga, I've been watching him. He's, he, he doesn't just... Stand, huh? He moves around. Very active player ito. Well, we'll see how they, you know, watch his minutes. Kasi kila, eh, kilanganin talaga ito sa, sa dulo. Felix Abreco. Jess Kilatan. Back to Kilatan. Set shot. No good on the three ball. The ball will stay uh, with uh, Val City. Check out the physical play down low. Kung makikita natin, tulakan talaga. Napakaganda. Oh, that's a replay of the shot. Jaisel. Agel. Basibas right there. Apreco taken away by Sarangani. Hit menace. Strong finish. And one. Reco trying to uh, no, no, recover from the error earlier. Nice pass here from Ludo Vise. Saktong saktong. Coach JV. Oh, oh. Talo at layup na lang. Apreco, good, good effort there. Sai. Natawagan lang siya ng foul. Jimenez with 5 points after completing that 3-point play. Alam mo bakit maraming nagchichir dito kay Kim Jimenez, Coach JV? Why is that? Nag-YouTube ka ba? Nanonood ka ba na yun? Yes. Uh, minsan. 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 But not necessarily basketball related stuff. Yeah. I'll tell you later. Pag, uh, Alright. Pag ano natin. Okay, Abangan ko yan. Oo. Oh, oh, may kwento yan. Bauzon fires. Wala. Rebound. Kilatan. Gonna get it to drop. Kilatan. Nag-180 uh, yun ah. Oh, Pagka uh, offensive rebound niya. One of the shortest guys on the court but nakita mo puso niya ang nakikipagtulakan doon oh, sa mga malalang players, players ng Malawas. That's his first. This was the first effort. Hindi pumasok. Isa pa. Ano naman? Just kilatan. So kanya-kanyang unang free throw. Alam mo si Delph, yung utak ko parang slot machine ngayon kasi nakikita ko mga players na iba na. I'm, 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 what, just when you have everybody memorize and who, what team they're in, suddenly I come in in the middle of a game and totally yeah. different. Actually, may, may major shake-up talaga. Yeah, even, even in our second game later on. Eh, Coach Davey, papakilala ko pala sa'yo yung ating courtside reporter, Mika Abisamis. 
Mika, meet Coach JV. Hello, Mika. Thank you, Sidelf. Hello, Coach JV. The Sarangani bench is full of cheers as Coach John Callis is about image this season. He wants major changes. He said we will not play just to win. We will take pride in every movement. We are hungry for redemption. Sidelf, Coach JV. Maraming salamat, Mika. And, uh, you know, just the turnaround na hinahanap nila Coach JV. And epitomize on that play by Jimenez Tubasitas. Oh nga, napakaganda. Ano, talagang two-man ball game. But what Mika was mentioning is perfect talaga because every possession counts and you really have to uh, capitalize on on the opportunities you get and not force things to happen. Back out to Jimenez. Nagpahinga muna si uh, Ludovice. So Jimenez is the main playmaker. Gomaro from the corner. That doesn't work. Parang may iniinda si uh, Dondon Gomaro. Oh, nagbagaan yung dalawang magkakampi. Bauzon gets it back. 20 to 17 ang ating score. As Bauzon cuts the lead to three. Jimenez again. Jimenez runs into traffic and puts it in. Look more like a brick wall. As in, Jimenez was floored. Seven points. Yeah, Reeve of Sang. Ang umarap kay, uh, kay uh, Jimenez. That's a hard hit. Hard talaga. Pati rin nga ang naibagay. Because Jimenez had momentum going for the shot. Once, once he got hit, biglang bagsak talaga siya sa sahig. And one of the players to watch here this season, Kit Jimenez, played for perpetual help in the NCAA. Pero, napakasikat nito, Coach JV, in, uh, in, in, on YouTube because of his uh, affiliation to the Mavs phenomenal na basketball team. Ah, okay. Yun yung, uh, yun yung uh, laging uh, dumadayo, dinodocument nila yung kanilang mga laro. They go into different yeah, and, they, and they have their own stories to tell. Kaya, you know, really, for me, it, it's revolutionary ginawa nila. Right. No, may parang reality TV eh. Oh, oh, uh, na basketball. So, syempre, uh, yeah. a lot of following, a lot of fans following kay uh, Kit Jimenez. That's where I saw that. I saw that league. Armin Neon. Naisingit pa yung pasa na yun. Shot clock running out. No good on the shot. Armin Neon again. Pinagay kay Bauzon, who uh, gets fouled, two free throws. Those are the kinds of shots I hate when you have to launch it because seconds to go na lang. But they get the ball back on a long rebound. Oo nga. Bauzon going strong for the basket, gets himself on the line. And this is the free throw. There's seven minutes remaining here in the second quarter. Grabe yung mga plot twist, no? Coach JV. Yep, yep. <laughs> Just for me to come here, that's another plot that people should understand and know what had happened. Pero I'm happy to be here, Sadaf. Nice to have heard your voice after two years of <laughs> silence. Silence? Silence ba yun? Eh, kasi nasa abroad ka. I've been, uh, been there since the first period. Showing a lot of energy. At sa ngayon mukhang si Kilatan, inaasawa na itong si Jimenez. I think he needs to stop. Uh, Inautusan siguro ito, pigilin na si Jimenez. Because si Jimenez can score. Yeah. Espinas, trademark turnaround shot. And Gabi Espinas announces his return to the MPBL with a, with a basket. 25 to 20, lamang na ang Sarangani. Experience personified talaga. Napakaganda, simple move by Espinas. Lilia Franca misses the three. It's getting too physical inside. Ogsang getting entangled with Basibas. That's what I was mentioning oh, earlier. Oh, Napakaganda, oh, physical oh, at oh, laro. Oh, Nakakamiss rin makita yung mga ganun oh, kiskisan oh, eh, no? Nakakamiss yung mga uh, MBBL fans. Oh, That's true too. That's true too. Na, na, na ano yung cellphone ko eh? Bigla na naman nayanig yung cellphone ko. So, oh yeah, so I need to announce Hindi ko po dala cellphone ko So all my friends, sorry uh, Please don't contact me Oh, nakita natin si Coach 7,500 views on YouTube at the moment Welcome everybody uh, On Facebook rather, sorry Villa Franca And one 
Kevin Villafranca. You remember this guy from Cebu? Yes. Now with uh, Valenzuela. A nice strong move, I know. His quick move to the basket was what caused Espinas to jump up and try to block the shot. Magandang fake na after that quick move. Uh, Villafranca now taking his extra shot. He completes the three-point play, so the lead is down to two. Para sa Sarangani, Sanga is back in the game. Gomaro. Espinas. Providing the pick. Gabi puts the ball on the deck. Gomaro, Matake, goes baseline. Sanga for three. That's a tough shot on Sanga. Naunahan lang ako. I recall Sanga hitting several shots when he was still playing for Kaloogan. This guy can hit back-to-back-to-back shots. The good thing about... Ito nagtataka ako kay Paul Sanga. Gusto niya may bantay. Oh. Halfway through the second period. Gomaro. Here's to the Vise. Inside they go to Espinas. Jumper doesn't drop. Ball will stay with Sarangani as Arminion lost the handle. Blessing off the miss. Last touch. Ball goes back to Sarangani. Bagsak si Gabi Espinas and they whistle a foul on Villafranca, I believe. Three foul number 31, Ray Ogsang. That's the second foul. Three again. Inside they go to Gabi Espinas. He lost the ball. Ends up with Gomaru Ogsang and Gomaru. Gawang buo ko sila doon and uh, nice display of sportsmanship. Oh, foul! Oh, oh! They whistle a foul on Ogsan. That's his third personal foul. I, I'm not gonna question call, calls anymore. It's just that nasasayangan lang ako on oh, the play that happened. They're all out there. The effort is seen. Sana na lang pinajump ball na lang. Ano? Kasi napakaganda. But still, we saw angles probably that the referees had a better look at it. So, foul siguro dun. And uh, what I don't like about that one is that they are in the penalty, actually. Both teams are in the penalty. Gumaru, it is a second free throw, but ends up with Sama! May dagdag pa na tres. Nabanggit ko yun. Back to back to back na binanang ang tinira niya. Excuse my language. And dami niyang ano eh. He took a lot of shots in the first quarter as Armin Yon just misses on the drive. Eight point lead para sa Sarangani. Sanga ulit. Balik kay Ludovice. He'll try. Short on the three. Valenzuela back the other way. Armin Yon. Villa Franca. Bauson. Nabas kay Kilatan. He'll take the jumper. Short. Rebound. Napunta kay Espinas. Ahead to Sanga. Titira kaya na tres. Hindi. Balik ka muna. May gumaro. Gabi Espinas. Plenty of time on the shot clock. Para dito sa Sarangani. Here's to the Vise. Baba ulit kay Gabi Espinas. Inside they go. Kaunan. Had position there and not be to a foul. Espinas is actually a- attracting two players. Oh, Kaya nakakalusot nito si Kaunan. Inaantay lang ni Gabi Espinas. He's not really going for the shot unless he's left alone. Ito na nga yung sinasabi ko sa'yo, Coach JB. Because balik na naman tayo. Buhay na naman ulit ang cellphone ko. Buhay na naman. Oo. And unang-una kong uh, mabatiin yes. ay isang uh, kaibigan natin dito sa liga. 
Mr. Christian Luanson. Coach Ooh, Christian Luanson. Coach Christian. Na nasa bubble ngayon, UP bubble. UAP uh, play, they're playing. Yeah. Uh, kaya, Bawal sila lumabas. Oo, oh, oh, kaya... Kaya yeah, yeah, ako ang tinawagan mo. Oh, hindi ah. <laughs> hindi ah. Hindi ganun. No? Arminion takes the three and knocks it down. Lead is down to seven. Ludovice. Go down low to Espinas. Double team. And that works for Sabal City. Brad Mecca had nine points in the first period. Villa Franca bumanga muna. Wala. A breko down low. Typical breko. Never, we'll never stop trying to get those loose balls, diba? One of the leading rebounders of our league for several years. Uh, Felix Apreco, former Latran Knight, has played for Muntinlupa, for uh, Pampanga. Parang uh, mainstay na sa liga ng bawat Pilipino. Oh, si Felix uh, he should end his career talaga dito sa liga ng ito. At it, hindi ko naman sinasabing in the near future yun, pero... Ilang years pang maibibigay nito si Apreco? Ah, tapat na si Felix Apreco. Yes, yes. Gomaro, down low. Espinas, Paul Sanga. Has the ball. Balik kay Gabby Espinas. Sanga gets it back. Top three. Pasok ya! Oh, I'd like to agree about the top three. Kay Paul Sanga parang wala eh. No, that's, a, that's a two actually. Ten points na. Ah, two na naman. Oh. Ten points na agad siya. So back to back to back. Sakto, sinabi ko, tatlo. Armin yun. Leaves it to Apreco. Labas kay Cabajo. Patrick. That three doesn't work. Agawan sa bola. Ends up with Armin yun. Cabajo attacks. Nice. Mecca. Backs it in. Nice drop pass by Cabajo. Finding his teammate. Creating space for himself. Attracting the defense. Then he drops that ball off. May 11 puntos na si uh, Brian Mecca. Ah. We're seeing some better scoring from uh, both teams here in the second period. Alam mo si Delph, highly noticeable ngayon ang defense ng both teams. After everybody's been hitting, especially Paul Sang, after he started hitting those shots, um, um, umakas na ang dipensa ng Valenzuela. Minute and 21 remaining here in the first half. Sarangani with a 5-point lead against Valenzuela. Babalik ang inyong MPDA. Gani Marlins coming out strong here in the second period. Paul Sanga with now with 10 points. Medyo matagal lang uminit ito si Paul Sanga but now he's in a fiery form. Ito si Paul Sanga, Coach JV, uh, streak shooter. And uh, yeah, that has been his trademark since his uh, career started dito sa MPBL. Yeah, and, and Aside from that, Sadel, he's an underrated defender. Huh? Nobody realizes how long his arms are. And he's put on top right now playing defense. Every time he extends those galamay ika. Great shot there. Kaso natirahan sila ni Arminion. yes. It's Andre Arminion. With uh, five points. Gomaro fires. Wala. Ivan Villafranca Notice the for the past couple of uh, possessions Tumitira na sa labas 
itong sa itong uh, Sarangani the defense talaga has really clogged, it, clogged up ang defense lead a break all alone down low but nobody saw him pero nakita mo handa siya mag rebound and Andre Arminion has busted that zone ng uh, Sarangani in the last two possessions first the three and then that uh, short jumper Armin Yon, quick seven points para sa kanya, all coming here in the second quarter as uh, Valenzuela is within one. Val City down one here in uh, the second quarter ng ating uh, opening day game ng uh, inyong uh, Mahalika Pilipinas basketball. Hey, Coach JP, we are back. We are back literally. <laughs> we are back literally. <laughs> Even here sa Batangas, we're back oh. in Val City. Oh, la la lapit na. <laughs> Para kay Coach JP. Very convenient. 20 seconds remaining here. Vando de Vise surveying the floor against Apreco. Six seconds of shot clock. Players, but everybody's ready to sag and clog up that lane. Vando de Vise, nagaanap ng mapapasahan. Labas kay Sanga, of course, he'll take the three. No good. May five seconds pa dito. Arminion. Kicks it out, Cabajo for three. No! And uh, that will not count pala kay Fredrik Sapreku. Great first half here between the two teams. Uh, Coach JD scoring, picking up dito sa ating second quarter. As soon as you arrived actually. 30, 35 to 34. Lamang ang Sarangani against Val City at the end of the first half. Ito ang inyong Mahardika Pilipinas basketball league. In five,
Maharlika ng bawat Pilipinong batang genyo, Maharlika Pilipinas Basketball League. At sa pagkakataong ito na mamayagpag na sa panakpakan, syempre, ang ating minamahal na Congressman Marvy Marino at ang ating minamahal na punong lungsod, Mayor Beverly Rose Abaya di Makuha. Mga kaibigan, kasama natin live na live dito po sa Batanga City Sports Coliseum, the home of the champions. Ladies and gentlemen, supporting right now, of course, nakikita natin ang minamahal na board member ng sangguniang panglalawigan ng Batangas. Mga kaibigan, Batangas, naririto! Board member, Arthur Bart Blanco! Also, we would like to acknowledge the presence of the most outstanding sangguniang panglalawigan members of the Philippines, beginning with the Honorable Councillor Oliver Makatangay. Also with us tonight, the Honorable Councillor Armando Mando Lazarte. We have right now, mga kaibigan, kinalang kinala nyo rin ang ating itinagalang na konsiha ng lungsod ng Batangas, the Honorable Councillor. Bumala versus Sarangkani At matapos po ng larong ito Ay sasagawa natin ang maisi Ang programa Of the day program Para po sa mahalik Ang Pilipinas Basketball team Panakpakan naman natin Ang NBL is the Senator Manny Pacquiao One of course As one of our presidents Dito po sa Pansang Pilipinas Mga kaibigan Handa pa yan
35 to 34 ang ating halftime score. Laban po ang Sarangani laban sa Valenzuela in this opening day game ng 2022 season ng Mardika Pilipinas Basketball. Hindi po ito throwback. Hindi po ito throwback. This is not a throwback. Let me remind you. So they have two pass sounds. It goes JB Gayos. I'm so happy you're back. I'm still thinking of how I truly feel. But being with Sedel, alam nyo na, alam mga fans ng MPBL kung paano kami nagmamahalan dito. Welcome. And I'm truly happy to be here. You've saved me so many times. And tonight is no different. Coach JB Gayoso. And we are back. Balikan natin ang ating first half ng laban itong uh, uh, Val City and uh, Sarangani. Actually, Val City got off a very strong start. 7 to nothing run. Coach JV and then bumalik ito Sarangani with an 8 to nothing run and uh, yun na nga no, natapos sa first quarter at 13 all and uh, bumulusok na yung Sarangani sa second quarter. Definitely. Ang nakagandahan lang dito, Valenzuela has actually relied on their second chance opportunities. Um, 14 to 6 ang lamang nila kumpara sa Sarangani. Ang kagandahan pa sa Valenzuela, offensive rebounding. They've never stopped 12 to 7 compared to Sarangani. Turnover, yung both teams have had eight turnovers each, but it's Valenzuela who has capitalizing 13 points off of turnovers. They just have to, okay lang mag-turnover ang team. Huwag lang patirahin ang nakakuhang bo, ang team na nakakuha ng bola. No, Val City in the ball game because of their hard work really, no? Ang uh, sihipag ni Apreco, Villafranca, Himpayan, no? Kaya, with, they are within one, although Itong uh, Sarangani had uh, a, a really good, you know, I've uh, 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 shot the lights out, especially second quarter. Uh, Here, na, eto yan nga, nakikita natin. Alam mo, binanggit mo dun sa first, yung, yung first quarter. Tingnan mo, nag-increase talaga ang percentage nila. 35%, both of them. It increased 27 rebounds ang Valenzuela, 21 sa Sarangani. But offensively, mas malaki ang uh, rebounding ng Valenzuela. 13 to 8 points of turnover. Diyan, nakakapag-capitalize ang Valenzuela. Second chance opportunity, 17 to 7 favoring Valenzuela. Uh, leading scorers here, uh, Brian Mecca has 9 points in uh, the ball game. Actually, 7 yung uh, first quarter niya. Nagtagtag siya ng dalawa sa second quarter. Actually, efficiency ni Brad Mecca. Plus 14 sa laban na to. And Paul Sanga naman ang nanguna para dito sa Sarangani with 10 points. First player in uh, double figures. Uh, and uh, the man na, that, uh, na inaabangan ng mga fans ngayon ng MPBL, Kip Jimenez, had 8 points and 4 rebounds to go with 2 assists in that first half. We're just about ready to begin the, the second half. Alamo said they're coming back again to do this this job with you. There are so many changes, I know, after two years of being away. Suddenly I realized hindi ko na mabasa ang stat sheets natin. Napakaliit. Kailangan ko na yata magpa-request ng mas malaking font. Buti okay. pa ikaw, nababasa mo. Dati kaya ko ba iba, mabasahin eh. Eh, nilapit ko nga yung uh, mata ko. <laughs> Para lang makabasa yun eh. Yun. A lot of familiar phrases. Even the fans here in Batanga City. Marami na naman bumabati sa akin. Hindi ko lang mabati talaga online. Kumakaway, nagpapabati online. Eh, hindi mo rin makita kasi nakamask sila. Ay, hindi. Actually, coming in here before actually entering, everybody was saying, batiin mo ko, batiin mo ko. And I go, oh. Uh, I don't know the situation right now kung pwede o hindi. Pwede naman, paminsan-minsan. Uh, Kitty yeah. Men is there, man in your screen. Siya yung uh, inaabangan ng uh, mga fans. Uh, magpakitang gila sa larong to. Third quarter. Underway dito sa Malanga City. Coliseum. Bola ng Valenzuela. Armin Dion. They go to Himpayan. Uh, one of foul. On uh, Reggie Boy Basiba. Si uh, J. Mar Himpayan on that drive. Great move. Five, Great Steve. move there. No, not wasting any time. Attack target. It's not about the points. It's what you can contribute. Adding a foul to your opponent plus a chance to score. Perfect combination. You know, we, we've seen this kid 
grow yes. dito sa liga na to si Jay Marie Payan from a you know, you know parang very raw uh, you know big Young man kid, and, yeah. uh, and, and then now you know blossoming into a, a very uh, mature and experienced player a lot of hesitation pa nung una siyang naglalaro eh, no? and, and then this time you can see he's very confident in what he's doing Lodavisa's jumper doesn't work nahayaan uh, nila Kaunan seemed to have touched that ball last, pero hinayaan niya nila. Last touch pala ni Apreku. Nakakatawa. Biglang dumami ang referee. Lahat pointing, <laughs> favoring their direction. <laughs> Bigyan mo na pito lahat niya. Oo. <laughs> Ludovice, Arminio ng Bantay. I love this matchup, but Ludovice comes out on top on that one. Nine points na para kay Ivan Ludovice. Andre Arminion makes his move. Jumper. In and out. Hit by a cleans up the list. Steady but true. In Payan helping his teammates out. Getting that second chance opportunity once again. At dun lumalamang ang Valenzuela. That's how what keeps them in this ball game. Masibas. Thought about it. Lumapit. Kaunan makes his move against Apreco. Oh, so mapit si Felix. Kauna will go to the line for two free throws. That's his second foul. Two free throws for Rick Kaunan. Rick Kaunan. This is his first foul shot. Played 12 minutes in that first half. Had four points. And uh, five rebounds. Misses both, actually. But Turns out to be a good foul. Yeah. On a break. For a break. Alamang na ang Valenzuela dito. 38 to 37. Mecca, umatake. Brian Mecca. Grabe siguro isayo nito ng pandemic, Coach JP. Oh, you have to maintain the, a high level of physicality. Para yung physical... Uh, Ability mo, yung training mo. And look at Kaunan dive for that loose ball. And the ball will stay with uh, Sarangan. See this guy behind, from behind the board, no? extending that right arm to make that layup. Kosanga forces that one. Shot clock was lining down. Arminion looking to push. Arminion drops it off. Abreco, the kick out. Cabajo for three. Pasaka! Papunta pa lang ang bola sa kanya. Teammates niya were already standing and giving that three-point sign. 43 to 37. Lamang ang Valenzuela. Jimenez. Step back three. Wala. Rebound ka Unan. The foul will go against Arminion. Hack to Unan there from behind. Look at this fast break. Familiarity ng dalawang dalawang players. Ang tatlong players doon. Ang tatlong players. Mata na lang ang nagko-communicate doon sa sitwasyon na yun. But in that replay, you saw hawak. Papunta pa lang ang bola kay Kabahog. Tumatayo na teammates nila. Kaya teammates niya. 43 to 38. Uh, they score uh, one of four si Kaunan in his last two trips to the free throw line. That's gonna hurt. Arminion makes his move. Drop pass. Abreku. Na traffic. Nilabas kay Kabaho. Wala. Rebound. Basibas. Kaunan. Nahihirapan. But it's all handling. The loose ball. Pitawan ni Mecca. Shot clock, 17 seconds. Maganda intention ni Jimenez pa passing to Kaunan. It's just that the ball skills of Kaunan medyo question ko. Lalo na may tao sa harap niya. Lodavice for three. No good. Rebound ulit. Jamar Impayan. Arminion. 
Mecca again. Again, see Manning. Going to get Abreko on the handoff. In fine, off balance shot. Voila, Abreko with a rebound. Under goes stab. Voila, Aparid. Gauna finally collects that ball. You can feel the aches and the pains. Sayang ang effort. Jimenez was fouled by Abreko taking that three ball. Pangalawa, second for Abreko. That's his third personal foul. The place, but that's enough to make that call. Kit Jimenez. Free throws for Kit Jimenez. First free throw drops for Kit Jimenez. Uh, you know, inaabangan talaga siya Coach JB you know, Ako rin curious din ako eh. you know, I, I've seen this, this kid play in uh, the NCAA And you know I, I've seen the videos on, on YouTube and, uh, you, 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 you have to you know, wonder Kung madadala niya nga yung Magandang laro niya dito and, and, and it seems like he doesn't have a problem Transitioning into the pros I don't think he will actually have a pro problem Playing the game the situation lang that he, he must adjust to is what the, the, the coaches ask him to do. Kasi dun sa kanyang previous league, he has full control. Diba? And in, in a situational type of a game, mukhang kaya naman niya, but we will see. Uh, very, I think this is a, his first game dito sa MPBL. Tingnan natin. Uh, he manages with a trademark step back. Wala. Nagawan sa bola. Ends up in Sanga. Doesn't need any invitation, Bosa. Hindi na agad yan. Galing sa labas. Punta muna kay Kaunan. Inside they go. Ludovice picks it up. Wala ang kanya tira sa ilalim. Sabaho to Himpayan. Himpayan attacks. Bots into Sanga. And he'll get two free throws in. Nakita mo yung galaw na yun, Jay Marie Bayan, three, four years ago, hindi mo na siya babangga. Hindi. Tatalo na siya. Totoo. Yan, yeah, ako'y natutuwa seeing him bump. The sad part about it, that somebody needs to inform him, no? Which was taught to me. Pag ikaw ay bumangga, don't fall back. Just go with the flow of your momentum and bump that person out. Whether they call a charge against you or you are a foul is called in your favor, Take whatever comes and learn from that. But if you always fall, rarely tatawagan ka ng foul. Paminsan-minsan. At yung tira mo will fall short oftentimes. Yeah, J. Mar Hipayan has been stellar in this third period. Do you recall at the time of Joe Rorsky, sinasabi, barreling J, di ba? And that's what we learned. We were taught you barrel into the guy. Spinas, binigay kay Basimas. Turn around shot. Red J. Mar Basimas. Venezuela with a two-point lead, 45-43. Arminion. Jimenez with a steal. Get Jimenez hang time. He is fouled by Arminion. Doesn't want to give away the two points. Fishing yata ang pinapanood ko, hindi basketball. Makikita natin sa replay. Iluna niya, fishing the foul. Here we'll see. He gets contact, gets the foul, then goes for the shot. Total difference na kita mo, he's barreling into the person. Kit Jimenez nails the first free throw. I like what you're seeing so far, Coach JV. Oh, oh because you, I'm here, right there, and I can see a few feet away what he's doing and how he's thinking. Tied at 45, halfway through this uh, uh, third quarter. By 11 points now, see Kit Jimenez. We'll go with four rebounds and two assists. Tabaho, Nahanap si Villa Franca. Lost it, recovers. 
for a friend. Turn around shot as the shot clock was winding down. Yeah, he needs to mama a shot clock violation. Turn over para sa Valenzuela. Great defense there by Sarangani. Much needed ball. Tight ball, tight ball game ulit tayo. Pangalawa na ito at 45. For Duaya in the ball game. Mukhang late ito si Ford Duaya. Mukhang may ninaruan pa. Oh, easy sa late. Ah, hindi, hindi, hindi. Hindi naman. Jimenez. Pagigay kay Espinas. Gets it back. Jumper by Gip. No good. Espinas. Two points. That's where you see the experience. Espinas. Once he made that pass, he goes straight to the basket. Alam niya na teammate niya titira. Trabaho niya mag-rebound. Puts himself in that situation. Gets the second chance opportunity. Jonathan too strong. Oh, almost a steal by Jimenez. Kilatan for three. No. Roaya. Todo trabajo again. Making up for lost time for Roaya. With uh, two offensive rebounds here. They have plenty of time to shot clock. Valenzuela. And Patrick Abao forced that one. The ball babalik to Sarangani. Lodovice. Against Cabajo. They go to Jimenez. Basibas will fire. No. Oh. They lose the ball. Espinas. Turnaround shot. Gabby Espinas with this yan. And he bound it Patrick Cabajo. Just Gilatan. Gilatan inside. Voila. Rebound, second serving for J. Mario Fire, who has nine points. Well, yun nga ngayon ang tumutulong sa Valenzuela, their offensive rebounding. Itong Sarangani needs to actually push everybody out and not allow Valenzuela to get second chance. What a move! Showtime para kay Kit Jimenez. Ang hirap na isolated ko sa defense ito si Kinti Menes with 15 points right now. Totoo, ang hirap talaga. But I, I was making you, I was pointing out something to you about Menes what I noticed. This guy is thinking. You can tell by his eyes. He's looking everywhere, trying to see, see different areas where he can help his team. Ang mata niya will tell talaga na nag-iisip ang player sa mata. It's been as on the run, lost the handle. Maybe not the best decision that time. Yes. <laughs> but you can tell he was actually looking. Ito makikita natin. Oh! Puts oh. Brad Mecca on skates there. Before the shot, kumingin siya sa paa. Alam niya, hindi makaka-recover yung defender. Challenge the shot. Get the minutes. Si ano, si Ivan Ludovice, pinahinga. Last phase, third quarter here as uh, Valenzuela is still trailing Sarangani 47 to 49, 223 remaining in the third.
Michael Desio. My name is Mika Abdesamis. And after that action-packed first half, nakausap ko itong si Paul Sanga at sabi niya sa akin, being the captain ball along with Gabby Espinas, they are leading this team with pride. Nung invitational daw, nakita nila ang mga naging pagkukulang. So sila mismo tumulong kay coach adjustments like balancing the work of the veterans and the young blood. Alam, the young blood, alam niyo na kwento lang din niya sa akin, ano, na uh, competitive daw talaga siya kahit nung bata siya dahil he was actually a table tennis team player. Kaya hasang-hasa daw talaga siya sa focus niya. At nakausap ko naman itong si Ivan Mecca. And he told me that he has been working non-stop for the season. Tinigilan na daw muna niya ang pag-online games para makapag-concentrate sa trabaho. He said for the second half, they have to stop Paul Sanga and the rest of the Marlins to stay alive. So, Del, Coach JV? Maraming salamat, Mika. Some Thank interesting you, Mika. Uh, facts there. Paul Sanga, as once a table, table tennis player, nagpipingpong pala ito. Alam mo, ang masasabi ko lang sa mga ganong klaseng sport na maliliit, ha? Ang tindi ng focus niyan, the way they look at the, the ball, you have to focus your eyes. Yun ang natutunan ko. But, oh, great defense there by Valenzuela. Kailatan. That's it is this time. And we are tied at 49. So, Jeff, I'd like to point out 18 offensive rebounds sa larong ito ngayon for, for Valenzuela. Eight points. And 22 second chance points na para sa Valenzuela because of their hustle. The hustle they're putting into in this game. Gives the lead back para sa Sarangani. Gusto ko balikan yung table tennis. Yung focus ng mga players na gano'n, matindi, is above normal. Because of yung mga tennis, table tennis, all these things with little bo the small body play, iba yung focus. Kaya pala, nagti-table tennis din ako dati. Talaga? Oo, oh, hindi halata. Check your focus. Hindi, <laughs> <laughs> but no joke, no joke. Above average ang kanilang focus. Badminton is another sport. Tindi. Yeah. He wants to 49, Sarangani with a two-point lead. JC Adjel, who played for Negros in the Invitational. Rowaya. And uh, good defense there, galing kay Gabi Espinas. Dinay nga muna si uh, Kit Jimenez. Balik si Dudovice. Inside, no! Like for the loose ball, heads up with Cabajo. Kit Latan is away. And he will finish. Quick fast break there. Nice dish out by Cabahu. Tablao at 51. Minute remaining in the third. Donald Gomaro makes his move. Pinagay kay Marilao. Back out to Ludovice. Espinas lost the handle to Roaya. Cabahu to Agel. Agel. Hang time. Pasokan. Inside they go. Espinas! And dami ng kinita ng jump shot na yan, Ghost JV. Yes. And, 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 and Ruaya has no other choice but to extend his arm and foul. It's right there. Kitang kita talaga. He gets so tempted. Medyo mamagal eh. Akala mo maraming niisip eh. But... Unorthodox kay Navashat. Especially for the defender. Tight game we have here. 53 all. 24 seconds remaining in the third. The good news is, may isang quarter pa tayo, Coach JV. Patrick Cabajo. 15 seconds remaining in the third. Patay na ang shot clock. Kilatan. Uses the Ruaya pick. Kilatan in traffic. Blocked by Espinas. Ruaya saves it to Impayan. Impayan puts it up and in. Share that point with Ruaya. Great effort there saving the ball to his teammate. And 
that will do it para sa ating uh, third quarter as uh, Jamar Hibayan has come alive here with a VC. The Marlins had control for a while. It is a third quarter. Kit Jimenez was doing well. Pero tiyong-tiyong nakabalik ulit ang Val City. Patrick Abajo contributing with that three. Jamar Hempayan also making his presence felt. And Kelatan has been a steady presence sa backcourt nitong Val City para naman sa Sarangani. Gabby Espina showing us his veteran moves there 55 to 54 lamang na Valenzuela as we head into the final period in 5 4 3 2 1 Inside the Watanga City Coliseum. Para sa laban ng uh, Valenzuela and Saragani. This is day one and game number one of the MPBL 2022 regular season. My name is Del Tupas. Asama si uh, Coach JV Gayoso. And take a look at our quarter scoring. Uh, Dikit all the way. Dikit all the way. And you can't say they're playing bad defense because everybody's hustling. It's just that they're playing great offense, both teams. Offensive foul on number 28, Gabby Espinas. Gabby Espinas whistled for the foul. An offensive foul, rather. Bola, babalik sa Valenzuela. Here's Patrick Abajo. Himpayan inside. Oh, matake. Si Jamar Himpayan. Great two-man game there. Cabajo not a able to score. Got, he'll do the next best thing, passing that ball to oh, streaking Impaya. That's 12 points in the second half para kay Impaya. And Espinas, pinalibagang kanyang dira. Kelatan comes away with a loose ball. Kelatan will attack. Kelatan will score. Going strong. Some will say, sinolo na lang niya ang oportunidad. But I would do the same thing given that situation. Great choice there by Kelatan. The Davise. Fade away off the glass and in. Ano pa gagawin mo? You play good defense. Hinarang mo na yung daan to the basket. He just falls, fades away, takes a shot and makes it. Cabahog na libre. Pasok yan para kay Patrick Cabahog. Second three para sa kanya. Walang kahirap-hirap. Ano? Set himself up for that shot. Uh, Valenzuela gaining some separation here early in the fourth. The Davise. Lumapit. Ivan off the glass. Wala. Rowaya comes away with a loose ball. Four rebounds. That's it for Rowaya. JC Agel. Oh, got, almost got that continuation there. I thought he had it. Oh, number 11, Paul That's his second foul. Oh, Patrick Abau. You don't do that to Patrick Abau on the ball screen. No, no, no. All he needs is a few inches for that shot. That's a bye-bye. JC Aj at the line. Played for Negros, as we mentioned, during the Invitationals. Pasok ang kanyang unang free throw. Balik si Danny Marilao. And uh, Kit Jimenez on the floor as well. Paulo Kiminales is also inserted into the game by uh, Coach John Talios. And it's an eight-point lead for Valenzuela MJS Zenith. Full court pressure now be being applied by Valenzuela. Jimenez, Andre, yung uh, batay. 
jumper. Kasaka. Nagahanap lang siya ng butas, ano? Just to take that shot. Well, he'll, he'll try to get to his spot. Yeah. And and obviously, he works on that jumper. Maganda, maganda sinabi mo si Del because many players find their spot. His spot is an open spot and then he'll take the shot anywhere on the floor. Yeah. Hey, man is leading the break. Hit. Draws the foul and he'll go to the line for two free throws. What an what a timely substitution here para kay Coach John Carlos. Pinahinga mo si uh, Ludovice na medyo pagod na rin. Pagod na rin. Meron kang Kit Jimenez na pwede mahugot off the bench although he missed that first free throw. Sixty-four to fifty-eight. Ang ating talaan. Seven thirty-nine remaining. Oh, second miss for Jimenez. I'd like to see situational basketball, lalo sa mga crucial situation. I want to see how Jimenez would react, especially when a set play is badly needed to set up and score. Kabaho. Baba sila kay Hipayan against Marilao. Jamar's jumper doesn't drop. Here's Jimenez. Jimenez dumapit. Labas muna kay Ludovice. Pasok yan para kay Van Ludovice. And Sarangani cuts the Valenzuela lead to three. Alam mo, Kilatan had no choice. Kailangan niya mag-double team against Jimenez. He had no choice but to leave Ludovice. 14 points for Ludovice. Babaho's jumper is short. Jamar Hipayan, just a handful dun sa labanan sa rebounds. Literally, kasi napakapayat niya at kayang-kaya siyang itulak ko, no? But he is a fighter. There you see. Kilatan had no other choice but to help on defense. Leaving Ludovice free. Great shot by Ludovice. 6.41 remaining in the ball game. Three-point game. Kabaho. Pasok yan once again. Long two lang para kay Patrick Kabaho. 66-61. Jimenez. Binigay kay Ludovice. Again for three. Back-to-back para kay Van Ludovice. Sagutan talaga, no? Jimenez creates. Ludovice finding himself free. Kitang kita siya ni Jimenez and makes the basket. Babaho finds AJ. Goes for the three. That's short. Gabi yung box out to sa ilalim. Ni Kiminalis siya ka ni Abrego o si Jimenez. That's his fourth round. Take a look at this three ball from Ivan Ludovice. Now has 17 points in the ball game. After those back to back three balls, Jimenez. Nakalusot. Jimenez lost it. Turnover. Jess Kilatan gets a breather. Solid job para kay. Kilatan. Yes, he, he played great defense. Ano? Si Kidlat Kilatan. Kidlat Kilatan ba ang tawag sa kanya? Baka. Wow. Shazam! <laughs> Here's our minion. A breco. A minion. Tend to shoot. Kabaho now. Dumps it to a breco. Back out to our minion. Back to Kabaho. Lumapit. Kabaho with a sidestep. Patrick Cabajo with 10 points to increase the lead to 4. His previous 3-point shots what is what made the defense run out to him. Pag habol sa kanya, he slowly penetrates, gets himself inside for that easy layup. Ludovice from way out! In the van, Ludovice with 20 points, 9 in 
the fourth period. Kaya pala ako pinapawisan. Ang init dito. Laro ni Ludovic. 68 to 67 ang ating score. Arminion. Ludovic is hurt. Arminion for three. No. The play continues. Danny Marilao waits for a friend. Pinigay kay Ludovic. Three-pointer. Wala. Oh. Loose ball recovered by uh, everyone. Everyone is there. Yep. Ano sila lahat eh? That is MPBL basketball for you, Coach JV. Oh nga, walang social distancing. Habul na ng bola. Nag-antigen test naman. Oh na. nga. Yan ang kagandahan dito sa liga natin. There you go. Yuminales. Parang napakadali kunin, pero ang hirap na ang situation na yan. Yeah, you love to see a veteran like Patrick Cabajo diving for that loose ball. True. And a veteran move by your opponent. landing on, You land on someone. Yun ang the best. Natata- Salbahay ako. I shouldn't... I, into ko na yung kwento ko. <laughs> Mabuboking ako. Arminion. Recovered by Apreco. Arminion gets it back. Teardrop wala. Rebound by Kaunan. Ludovice. Gonna make his move. Ooh, double dribble. <laughs> And uh, Ivan Ludovice, and he quickly acknowledges the turnover. Well, he had good intentions, you know. He, he out, tried to outfake the defender by making that pass. Kuno got caught by the ref. is back in the game. Babahog misses it. Here's Jimenez. Against Mecca. Jimenez for three. Wala. Rebound. Right, Patrick Babahog. Arminion. Two big men left behind. Mecca back out to Hipayan. Oh, oh. footsteps. You saw the hesitation there. He stopped. He could have hit hard and gone with the momentum to finish a shot. Instead, nag hesitate sa kaya he took and ended up taking extra steps. Final. We have a ceasefire on the floor. 68 to 67. Among our Venezuela, Lava to Saragari, Babale Kang and Pipia. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and Pipiel. Back sa ating mga fans dito sa Batangas City Coliseum. Babalik na po ang inyong uh, mga Arlika Pilipinas Basketball League. Uh, nag enjoy po kami. Uh, dalit sa inyong game na to. Uh, Commissioner Kenneth Torrentes, uh, Ever Oreta, and of course Rudy Distrito. Alam mo, earlier sa Def, nung tinawagan mo ako, I was with Chito Loisaga. I, I, I was telling uh, itong si Kuya Rudy Distrito that I was with Chito and wow, parang it was so nice to see him after so many years. Hats it, off. Hi, cheers kay Chito Loisaga. It was actually a sign of things to come. Yeah. Meeting friends today. <laughs> Tonight, <laughs> specifically. Siya yung the dynamite, ikaw yung grenade. 68 to 67, he menace. Trying to make his move against Arminion. Bottled up. 
Jimenez pa rin, umatake, pinilit, pasok out! Kay Jimenez! Upper body strength, never giving up. Great move by Jimenez. 69-68. Sarangani, lamang ng isa. Ilya Franca puts the ball on the deck. Umatake, he draws the foul. Two free throws para kay Villa Franca. Another example of going strong to the basket. Something they teach in grade school. Go strong oh, to the basket of cookies. And Danny Marilao whistled for his third personal. Ay, nihihintay ko yung ano, ha? Nihihintay ko yung balikan yung uh, drive ni Kit Jimenez, ha? Oh, napakaganda. Gin- ginamita niya ng katawan. Getting his, his moves created the off-balance de- uh, footwork of the defender. At may bangga solid to finish the shot. Buti Tablet. lang, mabait ako talaga, no? Pag-aro ko. Oo naman. Mabait ako naman. Talaga? Oo. Oh. Two for two para kay Villa Franca. Lead goes back to Valenzuela. I'm not gonna say it to Del. No, don't. <laughs> Baka wala kita sa oras. <laughs> Jimenez. Shopper. He will not get the bounce. Agawan sa bola. Ends up with Villa Franca. I thought he had it from our angle. Diretsong diretsong sa ring. Arminion. Pinagay kay Patrick Cabajo. Plenty of time on the shot clock para kay Patrick. Cabajo makes his move. Cabajo. Step back three. Kauna with a block. Cabajo lost it. Arminion for a three. Yes! Andre Arminion. That's a long two. Big shot though. Para kay Arminion. Long two lang ba yan? Oo, mukhang tres eh. Yeah. Was that an assist from Cabajo? Looked like it. Looked like it. Yeah. Luda Vise, he got the hot hand in the fourth quarter. And Luda Vise continues his scoring there. 11 points in the period, 22 for the ball game. This is going to give us a headache. Jimenez and Luda Vise are just playing awesome basketball. Mecca, Vinte sa kanya tres, rebound Luda Vise. Jimenez is ahead. Jimenez fires. Puts it in! Get Jimenez putting on a show on opening day in the MPBL. Gabing gabi na, bukas pa rin ang banko. Nice shot there. A prayer. Calling but, the but bank. But he had that shot. He, he had has. that shot, yeah. He had so that true. shot in his back. Get Jimenez. Ang hirap. At hindi niya gagawin kung hindi buong-buo na alam niyang abilidad niya to shoot. There you go. Setting his feet up. Actually, yung triple ang nagsiset up sa yeah, kanya. Yeah, true. As we've seen so many times in those YouTube videos, Kit Jimenez with a big three-pointer to put Sarangani ahead, 74-72. to 72. Pretty sure these fans are getting their, you know, your time nila worth, worth it. Yung pagpunta nila dito sa Batanga City Coliseum as Kit Jimenez has put on a show to put Sarangani on top by two. One minute and nine seconds remaining. Bola ngayon ng Valenzuela, Coach JV. Alam ko, matutuwa talaga mga fans dito sa Batanga City because many of them really love basketball and many of them love the MPBL. Oh! They're claiming all ball pero nakakuha ng foul. Si Jamar Hipayan 
Nakita mo naman yung atleti season niya doon na Coach JV nung pagtanggap ng bola. Hirap yun, ha? Hirap nun. I'd like to see that again, Juan. Being called for the foul. Maybe there was contact, but it happened so fast, hindi natin siguro nakakita nga ng mga IG. Oh! Oh, yun. May tama sa ulo. Ah, there is. Ah, ah okay. Nasa kamay yung bola, yung elbow, tsaka yung arms. Tumama sa ulo ni Impaya. So, Delf Jimenez right now and Ludovic are both 19 points. We have a timeout on the floor after Impaian makes the second. 74 to 73. Magbabalik ang inyong MPBL. Watch out for our opening ceremony at 9 p.m. Uh, mamaya po yan. Uh, and, uh, yeah, that will, uh, you know, you know, before the game against uh, uh, the Pit, uh, Batangas and Imos. Bago na yung pangalan ng ano, ha? Batangas City. Oo oh, nga, napansin ko. Embassy Chill na. Embassy Chill. Imos naman. Uh, Imos Bandera, GSC Truck and Equipment. Magandang gabi po sa lahat ng nanonood sa atin on Facebook Live. All 17,300 of them. Oh, really? Yeah. Yun ang ano, nanonood ngayon. Good evening po sa inyong lahat. 74 to 73. Bola na kay Kit Jimenez. Si Mecca nakabantay. 10 seconds to shoot. Jimenez nakawala. Jimenez will dive. Jimenez top shot. And he'll get two free throws on that drive. Fishing expedition, nakahuli ng isang foul. Yeah, again, off the triple. Oh. Yeah, makikita ang hirap, natin. Ang hirap, ang hirap. Single coverage is really hard. Very tough. You have to make him give up that ball. Harangin mo lang. Double team. Earlier, the sad part si Depp, alam mo, di na double team na siya. Kaso, ang bola naman napupunta kay Ludovice. At si Ludovice naman ang nakakascore. Jimenez, Mintis ang unang free throw. Second one, in and out as well. Up for Eko. Could not handle the ball. Wow. And uh, uh, for the a person who leads the, uh, the league in rebounding for uh, two, three years, imagine yung mga breaks na gano'n ang yayari talaga. The Davise. Has 10 seconds to work with. Waves off Jimenez. Likes this matchup against Arminion. Ivan, crossover, jumper. Pasakan! Ivan Lugovice makes it a three-point lead para sa Sarangan. That's what I was saying. If Jimenez doesn't have the ball and try to create, Lugovice naman takes over, makes this shot. Great move. Crossover, finding himself free. And just elevates for the shot. So, what 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 luxury para dito kay Coach John Calios no? Dalawang point guards who can take can over score. a game and create and open, get hit their teammates open. So, may ilang katalaga mag double team para mabitaw nila ang bola because yung mga big men who leave their man end up getting that ball. Like I told you, Sidel. Jimenez and Ludovisa will give us both a headache tonight. We're trying to figure out who. Wala pa, hindi tayo tapos. I know. Hindi mo tayo tapos. Kaya hindi na po mo nga pinabanggit na tayo ay pupunta into. Into the fourth. Yeah. <laughs> into break. the open ceremony. Kalo, break. Oh, into open ceremony. Oh, ah. Opening ceremony nga sa ating pamayang. 
Wow. Three point ball game. One Coach, possession. Itong uh, Bal City, uh, Coach JV, just yung momentum na nabuilt nila in the third quarter and even early in the fourth, nawala na. True. But you see, ang adjustment, biggest adjustment nakita ko is Sarangani prevented the second chance opportunities. Offensive rebound has gone down for Valenzuela. And that was actually what kept them in the ball game. So first three quarters, offensive rebound ng Valenzuela. Nahinto yun, di na sila makascore. And itong Sarangani naman, they have two deadly offensive players scoring despite being challenged. Seventy-six to seventy-three, and Adik score. Valenzuela has the ball. Probable, probable opportunity here for Patrick Cabal to score. Must need three. Sarangani, one timeout for Sarangani, but they are in the penalty. Wala na para sa Valenzuela. Para nuri natin si Jeff kung paano na babantay si Patrick Cabal. Villa Franca receives the inbound. Arvin Yon will go for the drive. Mecca fakes the three. No. Aga wants a rebound. Bola mapukuta. That's a rangani. They're going to review this. Seems like they're going to review to make sure. They got to their day over the last two minutes to determine the ball possession. The, the call on the floor is bola na sarangani. I'm surprised that the attempt made from the corner, the first attempt with the fake, tinamaan na siya, yung balikat na, tinamaan na sa pa, and no call was made. That could have been an easy call for a foul. Sir, kung uh, sarangani, finishing strong here, uh, Coach JV. Finishing strong and determined. Lalo na yung dalawang players na bumuhay talaga. Here, makikita natin on the first tip. Tingnan natin on the first fake. There you go. Saka iwas eh. Si Mecca. And the three. Ito. Tingnan natin kung ano nangyari dito. It looked like, to me, it looked like Blue touched it last. But the different angle must be seen dun sa kabila, you know, ng play. Because we had our, the back was turned. From this angle, it looked like... Kapareho rin, o. Yan, dapat nagpa-contact na siya. Dito na natin dito, no? Mecca. Dito na last touch dito. Jimenez misses it. When it, the ball it be, came between Marilao, Marilao, Mar Mar and Marilao, that's the angle we need to see. Toss coin na lang, si Del. Uso pa ba dito yung Dina, no? Oo. <laughs> ano dyan, if it's inconclusive, uh, what do they do? I think... Well, just to explain the the, the, the angle, kasi ay nalimit tayo sa ating ability to take full coverage of the venue. Alam ko, limited din tayo where we're assigned to make the shot. Now they're calling it ball for Valenzuela. It did look like Blue touched the ball last. Hindi ko pa pala kailangan na salamin. Good na lang. Salamat si Del. Then again, it's a one-point ball game. Three points up. Patrick Cabao. Three points. Three points. Anong na... Dawang dito. I mean, yun. Cabao. Ten seconds to shoot. Patrick. Throws it up. Short. Agawan sa bola. Ends up with Marilao. Danny Marilao. With a big rebound. And a big defensive stop. Coach John Callos. On bended knees. 
spray. Kanina nakaluhot talaga siya, nakapatingin pa. No? Wala pa sa penalty dito ang uh, Valenzuela. So, inbound para dito sa Saragani, dito sa backcourt. Have to put pressure here if you're Valenzuela. Oh, difficult. Pass, they're dangerous pass. Sanga is fouled. Pinasok na siya specifically for free throws. Ito si uh, Paul Sanga. At talagang maaasahan mo naman ito. Pero dahil ako yung nagsalita, baka na jinx ko naman. Huwag naman saan. You'll never know. Sanga sinks the first. I thought Paul Sanga's performance the second quarter Parang nakuha ng uh, Sarangani yung rhythm nila nun eh. Totoo. Got them going. So four point lead. Time running out. Kabaho, half court lead. Wala. And that will do it. Sarangani, Marlins. Isa lang ang pinanalo last season. And ngayon, nakakuha na ng isa. Agad. Yeah. Marlins pick up their first win. And indeed, it is a new page sa history ng team na to. Sa history ng franchise na to, it's Coach John Calios, victorious. And there it is, point guards. The final score here at the Batangas City Coliseum. The Marlins, 77. Valenzuela, 73. Big performances all around para dito kay coach John Calios and the rest of his crew he saw some big shots there in the fourth quarter coach JV great offense by Sarangani team two guys created it Ludovice and Jimenez and when they do penetrate they would dish off but more importantly they prevented second chance opportunities for Valenzuela which kept them in the ball game time and time again sinasabi ko yon maganda ang pag-box out na protect nila sa painted area itong Sarangani Rando Javise was uh, a man on a mission there 24 points 4 rebounds and 4 assists para kay Ivan Ludovice and I think he is uh, getting treatment as well uh, nakita ko parang may iniinda siya coach JB eh. that's true actually mar- maraming nga sa kanila oh, it looks like he's passed up on uh, the interview nonetheless big win para dito sa Sarangani Marlins matching their total from their last season in the MPBL already one win Yo, but magbabalik kami in uh, around 30 minutes for the opening ceremony ng uh, inyong 2022 MPBL regular season and pagkatapos niyan we'll have the game between Batangas City um, Embassy Chill and Emo City Bandera GLC Truck and Equipment para sa aking partner coach JV Gayoso si Dove Tupas saying uh, see you in a while magbabalik ang inyong MPBL in five, four, three, two, one, MPBL na.